Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Stars One. So what's going to happen today? Well, no clue. All I know is I haven't had any time to do any grinding or anything of that sort. And uh, yeah, so we know we have this titanium dioxide and I'm trying to figure out what to do with that. So I tried to put it into here and it, and it doesn't do anything. So the next step will be to create something that uses that. So I know I need to create an electrolyzer. Let's see here. Let's see if we can find it. I know we need to make this a distiller. So I need six plates, steel plates of that, which I think we have everything. So let's actually craft one of those. And then there's an electrolyzer, which I'm not sure what exactly what that does. Which we have the materials. Let's, you know what's funny? I think I needed this material for. Uh, yeah, that's my problem. I created enough materials to create this thing, so I need to pound up some more steel plates. So yeah, so this is how I've been doing the steel plates. Just been running over to the presser and throw these bad boys in here, and off they go. Consumes energy, so. Here's it's going down really quickly. So essentially, I just grab a wood log and dump a wood log into each one of these. So it, it creates more energy than what's being consumed. So that way, we can kind of rebuild our energy a bit. And then this presser here will just press them away. So we need a few more. Over here, I have my furnace running. So it's kind of doing that. That one's done. That one's done, so we obviously need more materials. We'll need to go on a harvesting run when it's daytime. These lights are amazing. I like them. <laughs> it lights up the area here, so that way I don't have to edit the videos or nothing special like that. So what we have in here, uh, nothing's changed in here. Yeah, I'm still working on doing the plants. We'll make the planters and all that, but the plants really aren't that, I don't know. It's nothing that special, but you know, the main push is to make this workbench high tech. This is the next s step, and yeah, so that's what we need to do. So basically, you just need to gather all these materials. The main piece is the steel plate. That's why we had to do the crusher, you know, the centrifuge, the furnace kind of idea, and then the pressing. So that way, then we can create these plates. Uh, I need one more plate. Perfect. We'll keep those. Uh, these should be done, which means that there should be just oh, 500 energy, excellent. The lights will slowly sap that energy, which is fine. So yeah, so now we can make this thing. I think we have enough. Let's go craft oleo. Bang! Okay, let's do this. So, whoa. Okay, size, size, size. Uh, let's see here. Let's rotate this this beast. Let's put this guy like this, maybe. Over here, woot woot. Let's see here. How close can I get this thing? Maybe like that. Bang. Let's see if that's in the right position. Yeah, I can put a light in behind it. It's at a diagonal. So now we can remove this workbench. I haven't used the anvil, so we'll remove that. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. So presser. Nothing's being done. So now we got the new workbench. So what does that mean? Well, now if you notice, we have access to new things. There's like things like advanced electronics, which takes silicone wafers. To make silicone wafers, we need to put these wafers, these ones that we smelt, we can actually throw these into here. And it's going to create a refined silicone powder, I think. I think it's going to create this stuff. Yeah. It's going to create this stuff which we get out of the is it the stone i think that's crushed down and then centrifuged this powder iron ore i think we get some from there too maybe not 100 percent on that but uh, centrifuge if we throw that there that needs to be centrifuged so yeah so we're we're creating this the silicon powder refined and then what we do is we use the presser and we throw where is it silicon powder refined and you're going to see something magical happen. I'm just checking on the power. I'm going to add some. I'm using up the wood first because why not? You're, you're going to collect that stuff anyways. I usually, you need the coal. You need the coal for crushing it and everything and turning it into other facets. So 
Oh yeah, the lights are gonna flicker. This this pisses me off because seizure warning. <laughs> I wish you could turn off uh, like devices so that way you didn't experience this. Okay, uh, let's see here. Furnace crush uh, presser. So yeah, see the presser didn't get to do its thing. Let's what's the distributive energy. Let's throw in a piece of coal here and let's throw in another with log here. Okay, perfect. Yeah, here we go. See silicone wafers. So these will turn into that and I'm not sure how much they use. Let's take a quick peek here at how much they use. Da -da -da. It's always a waiting game. It's always a waiting game and I'm running. I don't have enough power, enough power generation. So yeah, okay. So it uses what five units? So that's kind of cool. Seems pretty consistent. I know we'll need to make these. Uh, there's silver plates, which is of course the silver, which means that where's the silver? Silver, silver, crushed stone, lead powder refined. Here we go. Silver powder refined. This should turn into ingots. I think I already have a couple silver ingots. Yeah, these will turn into silver ingots, which is exciting. Let's grab those. Run over here. Let's take a look at these. Let's see what else? Ah, there's auto workbench now. So I'm wondering if this is the next step up. So we need to make advanced electronics and Titan plates. Not sure how to make those. Maybe that's with the titanium dioxide. Maybe that's why we need like the anal, like the all the other components. We have all these. So that's all right. Let's kind of scroll down this list. I don't think there's anything new in here. It's all the same stuff, same kind of stuff. Because it, this is new, Chemical Lab. We'll need to build that. That's completely doable. We'll just have to build these advanced electronics. Uh, what else do we get to build? Ah, we need. To, we should be building this one next, actually, the large you know, distributor of energy, because it's way more energy that it stores. I think it stores 2,000 units. What else do we need to build? We do need to build these like electrolyzers and we need to build the factory air transport which is going to take a lot of grinding, the factory transport which will take some grinding, a lot of advanced electronics we'll have to craft. So yeah, it looks like we, we definitely need to make some of these for growing. There's a geothermal generator which I think creates power but again advanced electronics. The greenhouse, I think we were able to construct beforehand, so that's kind of cool if we wanted to do that, which we probably should. Then there's these ones here. There's the industrial centrifuge, industrial crusher, and it's, again, using advanced. So that's the next kind of gate, is the advanced electronics, as is my understanding. Oh, cool, lamp call. That's kind of neat. I wonder what this one looks like. Let's craft one of these guys, see what they look like. That's new. It probably has that industrial look, that yellow medical capsule to heal, which is useless because we don't, we can't get damaged really. This is what we want to build: is the ore extractor again, advanced electronics. <laughs> There's a theme here. There's a screwdriver that's new, rubber steel ingot. Ooh, let's craft that. Not sure what that's used for. Maybe that's used for the other components, other pieces. I don't know. Steel powder, steel refined, sun panels. That's exciting. So silicone wafers for that. That will help uh, recharge our, our power. It's kind of a alternative power method. There's wind generator for power. That's definitely something to build too, maybe. That's kind of cool. Let's keep scrolling through here. Yeah, so basically you've reached the, the amount of knowledge that I'm at. This is kind of where I ended my, my, my original playthrough, the one I wasn't recording, the one I was just using to, to learn from to make these this whole series and so now you're going to kind of see from scratch what i'm doing right so now i'm learning more of the game this is the next step advanced electronics so i need silicone wafer silver plates which are very easy to do which means it's gonna be a lot of crushing a lot of smelting right uh all that kind of fun stuff and we're going to probably need to build more of these kind of stuff so centrifuge, where are you? So let's see here. I don't think we can do anything with that. No, that's why I, I built the distiller and I thought I built the electrolyzer too. Maybe not yet. We should build the, let's see. Let's see what the lamp column looks like here. That's pretty small actually. 
Let's put that right over here in the far corner. See what this looks like. Oh, I'm at, out of the power distribution. Let's see. That probably that's what the case is. So let's throw that back in here. A shift click should work. Let's place that there. Let's turn it on. Am I out of the range too? Is that range that little? It's just on the outside. Let's see if I put it here. Yeah. Okay, interesting. I don't know if I like this lamp column. <laughs> Let's throw extras into here. We can throw the anvil in here. We can throw... I don't need the shovel per se. Let's throw the lamp column in there too. Let's put that one right there. Let's throw the workbench in there. We don't need that anymore. And I think this is everything that we need now. Screwdriver, not so much. This is only when we build. Really, this is what we need at the moment. Okay. Distiller. Let's see what the distiller does. Let's see if we place that here. Okay. Uh, let's see if we are able to... Okay, that doesn't do anything. Unless it's not powered. Uh, can I look at the range? No, I would have to dismantle that. And I don't want to dismantle that. This should be in range. If the lamp is working, it's in range of that distributor. So, distiller. As you can put food products in here to distill them, to turn them into something, that could be a potential. We could just randomly throw a bunch of materials in here until we see it kind of trigger. But I think nothing is going to really work. I'm just kind of shift clicking in and out. And as soon as I see it move, I think it's something different. So we'll have to figure out how that works. <laughs> Man, okay. Well, we need to continue doing the centrifuge here. Because that needs to happen. And let's take a look at the power distributor since that will be the next kind of major step here. Distributor of energy. So we need eight accumulators. Okay, so we can totally build this 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 beast. So we need eight of these. So that means we need eight iron plates. So let's actually type in eight. Hit craft. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> then we scroll back down and we're going to build that that thing. Where, right here, distributor of energy. Okay, uh, eight conductors, I think we have that. Oh, we need more simple electronics. We need more of these guys. So let's see here, it's craft one at a time. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, what are we building? <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, we want to build, oh yes, power distributor. That's right, distributor of energy. So we need 18 of these bad boys. Do I have, I do have silicon wafers, excellent. So 15, 20, maybe just 20 of these guys. Uh, distrib, distributor of energy. Okay, let's see if I can make it. Bang, okay. You're gonna be satisfied with this one, boys. Boys and girls, what's going on? Why is there no power? Am I completely out? Okay, I guess I'm completely out. The autosave is kind of annoying, but it kind of keeps me on course. So let's get this power going again. Okay, and now we got this better distributor. Maybe we'll place it right here. There's not really a front on it. It works the same, but if you notice now, 5,500, right? And this capacity should be the same, 5,500. And I thought I had another piece in here now it should be charging and see so now we're accumulating to a maximum energy so you definitely want to build these ones because this will help expand this process right now what's next next is run down here in the dark let's grab our torch and we need to get some food lemons are the best because I'll show you here in a second extract extract Extract. These trees are growing. Let's run back. Man, this base is looking fine. Even though it's just a flat platform with structure, with stuff, it's still a fine looking thing. <laughs> so, the, the reason I eat the lemons is watch. 
bang, 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 six, four, three, two, one, bang, and then I just drink the water, perfect. And then we can refill our bottles, of course, right, why not? And it's as simple as running to the ocean, filling up the bottles, then we run back, and I think I'm just going to use the furnace, because it uses electricity. So basically the furnace, we throw in our wonderful bottles and it's going to cook them into water. Ah, you know what? I'm, uh, just gave me an idea. Distiller, right? What happens if you throw these in here? Oh, look at that. Is this how we make clean bottles of water without wasting? Yeah, look at that. Look at that. That is amazing. Nice. Okay, so that's the trick. So that's what the distiller is used for. Excellent, we just figured that out. <laughs> so we need the electrolyzer. That would be the next kind of thing here. And then I think we'll call it a little episode because you saw how we got to the high tech, the high tech bench, right? Which is that one there. So let's run over here. Let's go back into the distiller. So this, if this is all the distiller is used for, it's kind of a waste in my opinion, but at least we get our water one for one. So we get more bottles of water to replenish ourselves with. Uh, what's the power at? 900? 1000? Yeah, we'll just let it continue like that. Okay. So, next step. Next step is to build the electro... I think the electrolyzer. Elect electrolyzer. Because I think that's what we need to do to take this powder and put it through that, is what I'm assuming. Let's see if we have enough. I think we have... Uh, we need more it's the simple electronics craft uh, one of these find electrolyzer ah, come on I don't have any steel plates that's why we're never gonna have to make some more steel ingots which means I'm gonna have to grind which means I might do that in between the episodes here just because you know how that all works right so I might call it here actually you know we got the high-tech bench you know we've we're going to make this electrolyzer here and I think once that is produced then that's it and we'll see if we can throw this stuff into that and see what we get out of it I'm thinking that's what you do I'm not sure what an electrolyzer means I guess there's some technical scientific term to what that does and I'm thinking the developers just kind of you put it in there for the next kind of step right it's kind of like the gates to stop you so the steel kind of allows you to produce these things and then you know, these items will then allow you to produce you know, these things for the advanced electronics, right? Because that's the gate I noticed that I'm stuck at. It's getting to the advanced electronics, and I think this is the way to do it. It's the only thing I haven't tried. And the last time when I played, I didn't find this powder until I realized that it's through the process of crushing and and whatnot, or, you know, grinding up the iron or whatever, and finding it that way. So, yeah, that's kind of really interesting. Uh, which, uh, here we go, four, four steel plates, electrolyzer, we can craft one of these, perfect, let's throw this thing right here, it should fit, okay, electrolyzer, let's see, oh baby, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, what will this make, will this make refined titanium dioxide, which then I can throw into the furnace? Or will it create a mishmash of things? I wonder what else I can throw into here. We'll give it a shot. Ah, titanium powder refined. And I think we need probably five of these guys to make one titanium plate, which then means that if we want to create these ones, we need s silver plates. Ah, no, okay. So what do I need the titanium for? Is that just for these things, like the auto workbench? Ah, uh, yeah, okay. And probably for the industrial, so like the chemical lab, probably no the chemical lab. We can make once we make those things. What else can we kind of check on? Uh, right here, Titan plates, Titan plates. So this kind of allows us to open up into these factories, right? Uh, this one I think would be Titan plate. Yeah. So this is kind of that tier, right? See, industrial centrifuge is probably better. Industrial crusher, which is probably better. Then the, the normal crusher, industrial electrolyzer, which is probably better than the current one. <laughs> All of these are probably better, right? 
and then finally we have a medical capsule yeah okay that's actually we could craft that this thing or extractor this is what i'm going to build next because we have three diamonds and we have that ore vein right next to us so we need to get the advanced electronics basically which means that silicone wafers silver plates rubber conductors right so i will probably grind out the materials to make that and then that will be the next episode so i think this is yeah we got the titan powder right if we snag that throw that into the furnace Ooh, or is it more than five maybe it's more than five maybe it takes 10 which is kind of crazy kind of crazy oh yeah uh, yeah so there you go folks thank you everybody for watching hope you've enjoyed this episode and I look forward to seeing you all in, in the next one to where we make some Titan plates. We're going to place that, that ore extractor over there on that deposit there. Maybe I'll build a second one to put on that deposit there. And maybe build a geothermal generator. Maybe we'll have to build more power things to distribute the power over to that. I'm not sure how that's going to work or, or if we have to feed them. But yeah, But thank you everybody for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.